now your Super Doppler 10 forecast with meteorologist Jeremy Wheeler. All right, we'll get back to that. Let's take a look at uh, temperatures across the region right now. We've got uh, temperatures uh, which have been above average for most of the month. Now, th this goes back in time here. It goes back for the last 22 days, and there are only five days below average, and uh, several of these were, you know, about 20 plus degrees above average. So yeah, it's been very warm. We're six. 0.6 degrees above average for this time of year. And so, uh, yeah, it's very warm. And here we go again. More warmth coming right back at us. Today, high is 74, 75 Friday, Saturday, 76, basically mid 70s for the next few days. And that uh, today's high temperature depends on how fast we're going to get that clearing. I do expect some clearing. I'll talk about that. But right now we do have clouds and showers. 58 for a high on Sunday and then 62 on Monday. So temperatures are going to cool down, but we're still going to be above that average of 52. All right, so we have uh, area high pressure offshore. We have warm air coming in, and uh, there's a little pocket of showers here right now, but notice off to the west, a lot of dry air. This is going to be temporary. We're not going to see a lot of showers today. As a matter of fact, it's just going to be for this morning, and so uh, maybe a slight chance as we go into the next couple of hours. Right now, there's a decent chance of rain, 10% on Friday, and then a 60% chance late Saturday as that cold front swings through and cools down the temps. So Sunday into Monday, we're going to dry things out. But uh, late Saturday, we're going to see a pretty good chance for some rain showers. Pretty good chance for rain out there right now, especially in Hampton Roads. Let's have a look around. And so uh, northeast North Carolina, South Mills to Elizabeth City, over to Corolla, Grandy, you're seeing some showers. This goes up to uh, Suffolk, especially Whaleyville, Chesapeake, Great Bridge, and Virginia Beach. You've got it down to Pungo, Blackwater, all the way up to Allenton. And uh, we've got more showers in here. So let's have a look along 264. This goes for all of Norfolk, light showers, picking up a little bit around the Norfolk Naval Base. All of Portsmouth, some light showers. Uh, drizzle, though, here more towards downtown. And then up into uh, northern Suffolk, on up into Newport News, we've got some rain showers in Hampton and Pocosin as well. But it's moving slowly to the south and east, east south southeast and eventually this is going to move out right now a few showers developing around Surrey but that's the back edge of it and then here's uh, Matthews Gloucester County not too much happening a little bit up there around Saluda and a little bit more on the eastern shore Exmoor down to Eastville and on up into Parksley so right now temperatures they're in the mid to upper 50s in Newport News Norfolk 54 in Portsmouth 57 in Virginia Beach these are current temperatures folks it's warm outside right now 54 at Chesapeake 57 in Hampton mid 50s Suffolk and Williamsburg so you may need a jacket for the rain this morning but not, definitely not for the temps and you definitely don't need it today a lot of those showers will be moving out by 7 a.m. there might be a couple leftovers though 7 8 o'clock but then by noon some clearing partly cloudy skies few clouds along the coast Partly cloudy this afternoon. That's when the temperatures really warm up with that strong sunshine. Uh, temperatures in the 70s. Tonight, a little bit of clouds. And then tomorrow through the day, we'll see partly cloudy skies. There may be a stray shower too in the region, but there's going to be much less than we're seeing uh, for today. So uh, high temperatures. Here we go. 74 Virginia Beach in Norfolk, 73 in Hampton, upper 60s on the eastern shore, and some mid 60, mid 70s rather, northeast North Carolina. The showers are here this morning, then they're going to clear out this afternoon. Tomorrow, partly cloudy, 75, and then 76 on Saturday with those late day showers and storms.